Hello and welcome to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe if you liked this video. And thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you to my day ones, twos, and threes. Thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in. That means well. Thank you so very much. Appreciate you all and welcome, welcome, welcome. This video is for entertainment and educational purposes only. So everything is alleged, some is not. And the fair act use is in my description box, y'all. So let's get to it, y'all. Let's get to it. So since I put up a video about the palace, y'all, some more information has came out. Now, two things have came out. They were saying that Kate Middleton, this is coming from the palace, y'all. They saying that she was hiding out because, um, you know, she was basically, you know, doing damage control because of the fact that, you know, she might not like people of color. Okay, she might have, you know, a problem with people of color and she got called out on it. This is what they they were saying. And this is why she been had because, you know, she didn't want to get looked, you know, at in that type of way. So she wanted to play the victim. This is what they was basically saying. So she was hiding behind closed doors so that she could play the victim role instead of coming out and, um, you know, be called out for being, you know, not liking people of color. Okay, this is what one of the rumors were that came out. Since I put the video out, okay? The last one. Now, y'all, it's another rumor coming out. And this is tripped out because I don't know if y'all remember my day ones, twos, and threes that keep up with everything I'm putting out. They probably remember. But y'all remember that I just put a video out and I was saying that, don't y'all find it odd that she went in the hospital at the same time the king went in the hospital, y'all. And I found it really, really, you know, odd that, you know, he come out of the hospital and he's all over the place and he has cancer too. And he's older than she is. Okay, y'all. And he's all over the place. And remember when I said that, is it a possibility that he got some type of body part off of her so that he could stay alive longer? Remember I said this, y'all, that... It seemed weird for them to have one in there at the same time and this and that and this. Well, y'all, lo and behold, lo and behold, y'all, there are rumors coming out now that Kate Middleton is missing a body part, y'all. Now, for somebody to be talking about her missing a body part, it that just further tells me that this woman probably is no longer here, y'all. Okay, I'm not saying I didn't see them take her out or anything like that. But the way things are going and one lie after another, after another, after another, keep coming out about her and how she's doing and this and that and that and this, all of this edited stuff, all of these different stories that's coming out, um, people reporting stuff that, you know, she's no longer here and this and that and that and this. She's been in a coma. This is what they, a lot of people saying she's been in a coma since December. This is what they're saying about her. That she has no, you know, no movement, no nothing. Y'all remember Bobby Christina. Christina, Y'all remember how long she was in a coma? A long time. Until Bobby Brown, you know, decided that he was going to go ahead on and let her go. But do y'all remember how long they had Bobby Christina on that machine, y'all? And this is another rumor that's going around. But this new one that just came out. This new one that just came out, and this further makes me believe the last video that I put up when people were saying she's not here anymore. Remember when I was telling y'all this is what the word on the street was? She's not here anymore. And this is what, the, what really looks like is to be true. Well, this further makes me believe that last video that I put up that the people were right. Now they are saying that she went in the hospital last year and she gave a kidney to someone. But they are not saying who she gave the kidney to. But if you went in the hospital at the same time the king went in there, could it have been him that she gave the kidney to? Did this man use this woman for a kidney and it backfired? And is this another reason why that she could not be here anymore, y'all? 
and they're just using cancer as an excuse because now they're saying they a lot of people is questioning the whole cancer thing they're saying that no they don't even think she has cancer now they're saying that she gave up a kidney last year they're not saying when they're not saying to who out of all the people in that country you mean to tell me she's the only one that could give up a kidney to somebody and if that's the case was it the king because was she the only one that was a match they kept pushing these two together every time acting as if they had a really really close relationship her and the king was really really close y'all can google it and look at all the pictures of her and the king hanging out together and this and that and, that and this is this why they had such the bond that they had because she was a match for him for a kidney you gotta ask yourself this question now y'all and it's this whole cancer stuff that they're pushing out to the world is it a lie because they don't want to be looked at in a certain way they don't want to look at it like he used this woman for a kidney and then now her health you know deteriorated after that kidney donation okay y'all is that what really happened because this starting to make a little sense too he don't want to be looked at bad because she gave him a kidney and she passed away from the kid giving him a kidney. So they keep it under reps. Is this why that all the lies have been coming out? Because they don't want the truth to come out? Because this is what they're saying now. That she gave a kidney up last year. And her and him is just two peas of pie. They're so close all the time. You would be around somebody and up under somebody all the time. If you were, you know, getting ready to give them a body part to save their life. And you have to ask yourself this question too. Do he even have cancer? Did he just need a kidney? And she was the donor. And is it a possibility that she passed away from giving him a kidney? And this is why they were trying to keep it away from the news and everybody. Y'all, I got a feeling that soon and very soon they are going to be announcing that this woman is no longer here. And a lot of people don't want to hear it. And a lot of people is like in denial but this story right here, this last one that's just leaked that she gave out a kidney yet last year. This could be the truth too. And the other video that I did talking about, she's already gone. That could be the truth too. Did she give up a kidney and lose her life, y'all? Could this not even be about her husband doing something to her? But her decision that she made to be a donor to this man right here. And everybody is going to look down on him because if something happened to her for donating this kidney to this man. It's going to make him look really, really bad, y'all. That he couldn't go to anybody else but to go to his son's wife and get her kidney. This is going to go. This is going to look bad for him. And then if he still has cancer, people are going to look at it even worse because they're going to be like, well, you are already sick. Why would you take a kidney from this woman? And she's the future queen. Y'all, this mess right here is getting ridiculous. But this is what is being said right now. That this woman gave up a kidney last year. Boy, oh boy. She didn't weigh but 40 pounds in the first place. Why would she go put her body through something like that? If this is true, because I keep telling y'all, they keep coming up with story after story after story after story. But when I look back at all of the pictures of her and the king and how they act like they had a perfect relationship, like they were really close, it makes you wonder. Because I know someone that gave his mother one of his kidneys and they were really really close like they were always together and this and that and that and this and they were eating healthy and all of this stuff so that they would you know be able to give the mother a healthy kidney and now y'all this would make sense if her husband had nothing to do with what happened to her and his father did are the people going to look down on the king in the decision that they made to put this woman's life in danger? 
to save him and he's already with one foot out the door in the first place i'm, I'm not trying to be mean i'm just saying y'all this kind of makes sense y'all do you have to just put the pieces together that sounds right with this whole situation because there's so many lies that's coming out of the palace right now that you don't even know what's true or not anymore now they're saying that her husband is about to start you know going back to work and start doing what he's supposed to be doing as the prince this is what they're saying Prince William returns to public duties weeks after Kate Middleton's cancer revelation. Okay. Now the thing of it is, if she's doing so bad, why would he leave her side to go back to work? Wouldn't you be there with her? Or are he, is he, is this the time when they're about to make this announcement? They're going to say that he is doing his duties off somewhere and then he got a call and that she passed away. Is this how they're about to play this, y'all? Is he tired of sitting around waiting for them to decide what they're going to do and say about this whole situation? This is really ridiculous. Why won't people just tell the truth? I don't understand what's wrong with telling the truth. Every time you tell a lie, you got to tell another one and another one and another one. Every single time. This is ridiculous. They went from saying she's having abdominal surgery. Now they're saying that she gave up a kidney. Then they saying she got cancer. Which one is it, y'all? Which one is it? What, what is people going to find out later that she, you know. When people start talking about body parts, it makes you wonder if somebody is still here or not. Especially in they're saying now that she got a kidney missing. Y'all, let me know what y'all think about this new revelations that they have coming out right now. And what do y'all think? Because I sure said this. I said this too. I said it. I said it. I said, did he, did she give this man a body part? Did he use her for a body part so he can live a little bit longer? And if he did, this was so selfish of him to do some stuff like that. That's if this is true. But this is somebody from the palace is the one that's saying it. Somebody from the palace is the one that's saying that she gave up a kidney. Y'all let me know in the comment section what y'all think about this. Anyway, y'all, please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.